Hello friends, welcome to Medilab Swim YouTube channel. This video is about alpha fetal protein tumor marker. So this video includes what is alpha fetal protein, the reference range of alpha fetal protein, how the alpha fetal protein test is done, what does the test result mean. I hope you will watch my video until the end. I know finally you can get more knowledge about alpha fetal protein tumor marker so if you like my channel please consider subscribe and click the notification bell also let's start what is alpha fetal protein Alpha fetal protein is a protein produced in the liver of a developing fetus. During a baby's development, some alpha fetal protein passes through the placenta and into the mother's blood. An alpha fetal protein test measures the level of alpha fetal protein in pregnant women during the second trimester of pregnancy. Alpha fetal protein levels are typically elevated when a baby is born and then decline rapidly. Liver damage and certain cancers can increase alpha fetal protein concentration significantly. This test measures the level of alpha fetal protein in the blood. What is the normal range of alpha fetal protein in pregnancy? Maternal alpha fetal protein levels in pregnancy start to rise from about 14th week of gestation up until about 32 weeks gestation between week 15 and 20 weeks. Levels usually range between 10 nanogram per milliliter to 150 nanogram per milliliter. Adult blood levels of greater than 200 nanogram per milliliter in patient with liver cirrhosis strongly indicate hepatocellular carcinoma. How the alpha fetal protein test is done? Test preparation and sample type. You don't need any special preparation for alpha fetal protein test. A healthcare professional will take a blood sample from a vein in your arm using a small needle. After the needle is inserted, a small amount of blood will be collected into a test tube or vial. In pregnant women, what do the results mean? If your results show higher than normal alpha fetal protein levels, it may mean your baby has a neural tube defect, such as spina bipeda, a condition in which the bones of the spine don't close around the spinal cord or enencephaly, a condition in which the brain does not develop properly. If your results show lower than normal alpha fetal protein levels, it may mean your baby has a genetic disorder such as a Down syndrome, a condition that causes intellectual and developmental problems. If your alpha fetal protein levels are not normal, it doesn't necessarily mean there is a problem with your baby. It may mean you are having more than one baby or that your due date is wrong. You may also get a false positive result. That means your results show a problem, but your baby is healthy. If your results show a higher or lower than normal level of alpha fetal protein, you will likely get more tests to help make a diagnosis. Non-pregnant female or male adult. What does the test result mean? Increased alpha fetal protein levels may indicate the presence of cancer, most commonly liver cancer, cancer of the ovary or germ cell tumor of the testicles. However, not every liver, ovarian or testicular cancer will produce significant quantity of alpha fetal protein. Elevated levels may sometimes be seen with other cancers such as stomach, colon, lung, breast and lymphoma. 
although it is rarely ordered to evaluate these conditions. Other diseases such as cirrhosis and hepatitis can also cause increased levels. When alpha beta protein is used as a monitoring tool, decreasing levels indicate a response to treatment. If concentration after cancer treatment do not significantly decrease, usually to normal or near normal levels, then some of the tumor tissue may still be present.